Hello, today I will show you how we can do update from the version 2.25 to the version 2.70. Yeah? Uh, I will move from here with the camera, I will capture the screen from the computer and I will show you a tricks how you can install this, uh, this version on the same uh, firmware. It's not necessary to, to program the uh, processor inside the chip. Okay, we'll move over there. But before to to move to desktop to show how you can install it and how you can play with the software, uh, I must to mention that this is a clone from China and you should use this clone or this uh, kind of programmers or tunings only for yourself, okay? Like DIY, do it yourself. Maybe for your friends or for somebody from the family, but uh, I don't know. Don't use it if you have a service. It is not proper tool. You will have problems. Uh, I will show you also in the one of, of the video how how I destroyed the ECU. I will don't tell you which car. It's a surprise, but I can show you how how we can uh, destroy the uh, ECU. It's very easy to to destroy it with these uh, clones and. Do it on your risk, okay? What I will show you here is on your risk. I don't recommend to use these uh, clones. You can uh, use it, but before to use it, it is better to make a full rework inside. I will show also the difference between this one and another one who have rework. Or it's the same story, same, similar with uh, case. I will show you in another episode to, to the case, okay? Inside, how you can rework it and what is necessary to change over there. But now let's uh, move to, to the desktop. Okay, now I will show you how to do update from the version 2.3 to version 2.25 but to have all the protocols from 2.70 the version 2.70 doesn't work for the, these clones but at least we can have all these protocols and uh, the cars available and we will use um, 2.3 uh, 25 because it's most uh, stable from all of them. First uh, step is to extract uh, the version 2.23 is the native version and you should uh, proceed the install it is very simple. You need all these files in the, in the system inside in the windows like this is the reason why you should install the native uh, version from 2.23. Anyway, this one works also with, with clones. And if you like it, you can keep it, but you don't have so many uh, cars inside also for CAS or for KeyTag. It's a very old version. And you don't have so many protocols open over there. I do this video to show you how you can uh, use the Kitak clone on the full capacity of him. In another video I show you how to update the card if you have the problem wake up error or if you want to ha uh, update with uh, uh, also new protocols or to change the card. You will have this error most of the time. It happens also when you run the Windows uh, 64 like me, but don't worry, we we'll move from there, we we'll move over here, and then we'll start on the driver from here. Okay, and that from here we, we don't have error anymore. of the Windows 64 bits we have these errors but let's see if it works or not uh, this was I believe it was already installed I don't was so concentrate on the screen okay we close everything we plug the cable and let's see Ok, 
okay driver it's already installed as you can see i don't have internet connection for this uh, version 2.23 with another one you can work also if you have uh, internet connection okay let's start it okay you can see it was detected we close now we have here the version 2.70 we extract this version okay we do we are finished we move this version over here okay we install again the drivers they have same drivers but from my experience uh, i tried also once and he doesn't work before to install the drivers from this version i don't know why don't ask me for much reason yeah we have same error we unplug the cable okay and we're trying now to run and as you can see he will do he will do now the updates automatically on the screen over here you leave it like that it takes i don't know five minutes ten minutes depends depends how fast is the card and you will have all these protocols in inside from this family basically they are the crp and when we are finished we can move to version 2.23 or you can move to the version 2.25 which is very stable also depends which one of them i have a stable version and i'm happy with, with this version It is very shiny because we still find on the market this very old version for eight years ago. Doesn't matter if they are uh, copy from the copy, clone from the clones. This uh, from China, they should give us better version because not all the people have money to, to buy uh, Kitag or, or Kes. I don't know if you know uh, how much it is the price, but uh, I sent the email to uh, alien tech company and i they send it me back and you cannot believe it uh, yes with all these protocols with all these options uh, it was 39,000 euro yes you hear it good 39,000 euro and kitag 9,000 euro <coughs> Yeah, don't worry because this uh, because of this error, he searched for the internet. But again, we don't work with this version. For example, now the Kitag is uh, have all these uh, protocols family inside, and we should. I do have here 2.25 this is lot of what I like it more and yes if you ask me uh, you should keep all of them yeah I keep it both in the computer also 2.23 and also 2.25 I don't need this anymore 2.70 I can delete it I use it only for the updates update the card I must to uh, tell you which update update the card okay what is inside over here 
in another video from me you see how can you uh, write the image if you have problem with the card okay now we have everything here and as I said all the time I instruct the driver from each patch I don't know if it's good or no for example now my windows play with me this is the things what I don't like it in windows uh, 7 it is very slow compared with windows 10 but I'm not so sure if uh, Kitag or this old version from China can work on windows uh, 10 Okay. Uh, okay. Can we move here? And we should send this to the desktop and yeah, we can go from here. Okay. No connection. This is very bad. Let's see what do I have here. Okay, again no connection. You know, let's try to oh, fuck the table. As you can see, after installing the driver, he doesn't work. You must to unplug the cable. We are trying to put it now back. Okay, we are trying to start this again. Of course, no connection with the internet. Let's see what we do have here. Okay. We go Okay, let's go to DM Let's see what we have from the first series Yeah, now we can use it also for uh, newest version for Petro, for example, 2015. Before that, uh, I couldn't use it. And yeah, let's see how many cars we have here. Okay, let's move to five series. Let's see what we have here on the S10. 2014, 10. You don't have uh, great protocols anymore. And the menu work much, much faster if you ask me. React very quick. Look. Uh, yeah, still, still a fake version. Of course, the cars they are very old. I mind like. 2013 uh, Let's see on Volkswagen Yeah, this is 17 C46 Okay, not bad Really not bad What is very good, you don't have great protocol anymore. Okay, th this was the reason I want to make a short video, not too much, not too, not too long. And this was the main reason to show you how to do updates. It cost you nothing and it worked perfect.
see us to the next episode okay bye bye Thank you.